clean this. I have nothing to wipe it on. Wipe it on the steering wheel. Still has as much, but whatever. What is up you guys? Welcome and welcome back to another episode of Christmas with a K. I am your host K Roche and today we are gonna have a good day. Duh. <laughs> Let me stop but what's up y'all? Welcome back to my channel for those of you or, oh my god. What is up you guys and welcome to my channel for those of you who are new. Today we are on our way to Walmart. Now if you couldn't tell or you didn't know I am back at home for the semester. Yes, I am not officially over though or done with classes. I have two finals that I need to take as soon as I get back because they're due tonight. Wait, is it the 8th? No, it's the 7th. Why is this wrong? I was about to say, if it's the 8th, I'm done for. I missed them. But I have two finals due tonight at 11.59. 11.59, I have two finals due. So I need to make it back. It is currently 4.55. I am making a very late start to the day. But you know what? I need to get some stuff done. I wanted to relax being back home like the first day, like officially. I came back yesterday. And so like today I got to wake up like in my bed, like at home and just chill. I'm not going to work until next week. I already told them. So don't even try and call me in. I'm not going to work until next next week I'm just vibing out just chilling and I just wanted to really experience that today so that's what we did we took our time getting ready I am dressed and kind of cute we have on a light little fit I'll have to show y'all in a second yeah I thought it was gonna be a lot colder here so I brought a lot of my cold clothes and I probably should learn to check the weather before I pack to go anywhere because it's 71 degrees and all I have is coats so I stole this from my mom's closet don't tell her that I have it I'm wearing a jacket only because it's like gloomy as y'all can see and like rainy it's not raining right now but it's been like misting all day the ground is wet it just looks real gloomy so I just wanted something with the hood and to keep the girls covered up and all that jazz but anyways I ordered a lot of stuff when I was gone between Black Friday and me coming back for Christmas gifts so I'm pretty much done with everybody I have to get like a few more things for my boyfriend one more thing for my mom which I think me and my sister are gonna do together and I have to place an order for my brother but I know everything that I'm getting for these people I know I said these people like they're random so a lot of the stuff is already added to cart it's just about ordering them I need to get on that but it's only the seventh like I said and sorry my car is so annoying it is old and on its last leg but please bear with me as I drive and this sound hold on I have to hold on to y'all because y'all will go fly okay but yeah so I ordered a lot of stuff and we just don't have any gift wrap and it makes it real hard before I told them every package that comes in that has my name on it obviously they don't open my stuff anyways but sometimes especially around this time they may get a little nosy and try and open some packages that I had delivered to the house and not to my apartment so I just told them everything that has my name on it do not open it. Do not even get a hard look at the box because just mind your business. They like started piling up in my room and I wasn't expecting to have as many packages. I didn't realize how much I could. Jeez, y'all gotta sit still. Put your seatbelt on. Put it on. I guess I didn't realize how much I ordered for everyone. And it's crazy because we said we weren't doing gifts this year and then last minute we decided to. So I don't know how I ended up getting so much, but apparently I did. We said, I got all these packages. I don't, since I've opened the boxes now, the gifts are like low key exposed. I don't want to have to deal with having to hide it around the house and all that jazz. So I'm just going to Walmart now to go and pick up some wrapping paper. I think I want to make some like crumble cookies. I guess like a mock recipe that I've seen people make yeah I've seen them and they looked pretty good so I think I'm gonna try and do that so I'm gonna grab the stuff for that and if y'all can hurry up so I can turn that would be great and yeah but we're gonna wrap some gifts but... y'all gotta say still now y'all on the floor but yeah I probably picked the wrong time to come out because traffic is booming but I'm gonna update y'all when I get to the store because y'all don't know how to sit still and I ain't got time for it so I'll see y'all in a minute alright y'all I'm in the Christmas section but they are playing music I can't talk too much I'm deciding between these two wrapping papers both of them are reversible I don't know if you can see I might just end up getting both but I think one will be enough I don't know I never buy the wrapping paper my mom usually buys it so I don't know if one roll will be enough for the gifts that I have looking for a ribbon
Oh, here's Ruben. I like to make my gifts cute. They have these packs, but I don't need all of these. Like my skims dupe, I just ordered like a whole bunch of skims, but I had to try this dupe because it looks cute. Okay, this is just straight up ugly. What is this, plastic? No ma'am. No ma'am. Okay, they just don't have a good variety. I'm not just gonna get it to get it and then I know I'm not gonna like it. I'm gonna try and look elsewhere. I also need tape. Oh, I just want the cutest gift bags. Still no ribbon. Just try the craft section. All right, y'all. So I have since left Walmart. I'm sorry, I didn't vlog too much in there because I just be ready to get in and get out when it comes to Walmart. Like it just be too much going on. Especially at this time of night, like it's all the moms going after work to pick up what they need for dinner. That type vibe. And no, no, like disrespect to you. I just don't want to see you when you go and do those things. So I was trying to get in and get out, y'all. I got a really late start to the day. Like I didn't start. I didn't get out the shower until like four o'clock. Yeah, but it is actually hot. The weather was not lying. Not this go round. Cause I'm actually hot. But I left Walmart. I was gonna go to a few other stores, but I really don't feel like it since it has started raining since. So I just wanted to stop here really fast. I don't want a meal from Wendy's. Oh, I'm at Wendy's. But I don't want a meal from Wendy's. I just heard that they got these new fries and they're supposed to be like like garlic fries. And y'all know me. I love me some Wendy's. Wendy's is my go-to fast food joint. But I just I'm just not feeling like a Wendy's meal today but I heard somebody talking about the fries so I was like let me just go get some fries and I haven't eaten at all today mind you I've been up since like 8 and then we'll have to find something when I get home I'm sorry this lighting is terrible y'all I hate going through new drive throughs that I've never been in it's one of my biggest fears y'all know I literally like just got over my fear of driving like how do I have a license I really don't even know because I didn't get my license until I was 19 about to turn 20 like like two months before my 20th. I was terrified of driving, but COVID kind of pushed me into it because I got tired of being trapped in the house. And I bought a car during quarantine, like without having a license, without having a permit. Like I didn't have nothing. When I tell you nothing, I have nothing. And I probably had sat behind a wheel, like and actually driven three times before I bought a car. How did it work? No, but I bought a car just because I was the right age, I guess. Yeah, so we had that, and then I just got tired of being cooped up in the house. I couldn't do that for too much longer. So then I started like driving around with the windows down. I would drive around my quota sack. Like I didn't I obviously didn't have a permit, I didn't have a license. So my mom would like confine me in a like certain spot, which I get because I'm already terrified of driving. Like, why am I driving this vehicle by myself? Like she would not be in the car. In my old neighborhood, we had like two quota sacks. Maybe like in total, this route was like three minutes from my house up in this quota sack sack turn back around through the cul-de-sac come back out go past my house drive up this cul-de-sac turn around and then come back and i would do that for hours hold on how can we just one moment okay i don't see it on the menu oh yes Hi, can I get um a order of garlic fries? And that's all. Very four fries one Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. I was about to pay my freaking school ID. But it actually does work as a form of payment by my school. What was I even talking about? Oh, I finally mustered the courage to like go get and like take my test. Obviously I was like of age, so I didn't have to get a permit. I could just get a driver's license. I literally just, I did the written test like a week before I had my driver's test. It was also during COVID, like I said, the testers weren't allowed to get in the car with you. And we were just allowed to have one other person in the car. So my boyfriend came with me and he just stayed in the car. Then they're like, oh, he can ride with you. It's fine, but he cannot talk and he cannot, any of that is an immediate zero. Yeah, he sat in the car next to me and it just made me feel more comfortable knowing that he was here and then i i honestly was supposed to wait like i think i was supposed to wait like a month between taking my driver's test but i took my permit test and i failed it the first time and i took it again and i passed with flying colors the second time because i just didn't know what to expect like people say that they study for their permit test and i was like i ain't never really studied for no test so i don't think i need that girl i went in there and i was like huh i was like huh who knew that Oh yes, please. Thank you. You're, you're welcome. Have a good night. You too. Yeah, and then I took my driver's test and I passed with like an 87. That was that. I've been driving ever since. And I'm actually very proud of myself. But anyways, all that to say, I hate going through new drive throughs that I've never been in because um, that's scary. This is like a 12 year old working. How old are you? Is this legal? Kate B. Be fucking for real. Thank you. You too. To make sure.
Yo, Wendy's got some tea going on. y'all so we are finally home and first thing i'm gonna do is try these fries because i'm very excited about these and kind of hungry but i was drinking this in the car i just wanted to tell y'all these are so good i like treat myself to one of these every now and again and they're just so deliciously tasty um flavored almond milk smoothie with other natural flavors ingredients this is a naked orange cream creamsicle like it's like a dessert drink too good if you're curious that's what i was drinking try these fries hopefully they're not cold or not too cold but it comes in a little plastic container y'all that smell oh that's garlicky <laughs> that's garlicky okay they're not crispy like as hot as i would have wanted but they're still really good i'm not even gonna lie to you but they're good if you haven't tried them let's do a quick little haul of what i got i spent a total of 43.37 at walmart what did i get for that can't even tell you but we're about to go through these are like my new favorite snack like i've always loved fruit like i love i love fruit fruit is just so delicious mm -hmm. especially on like a summer's day what a little picnic by the beach oh i like have been sleeping on apple Mm. I got these to snack on like in the house. I've been joking. I could probably go through this whole bag in like three sittings. And I got this cup. I honestly got this for my sister. I don't mind showing y'all one because nobody's here right now. She's like, oh, she should be here pretty soon. So I need to hurry up. But I ordered one of these before. She loves like cups like these. And I had a cup that's my car cup. She saw this and she was like, it's so cute. I was like, I know. Um, and so I took note of that. It was like a few months back and she was like, you should have got me one. So I just took note and I had them at Walmart. These are the holiday edition. I really want to get the white one that's iridescent because it's so freaking pretty. And girl, I went back and they were gone. For the gifts, I ended up picking up two green bows to the job. This cute little gift bag, this was like three bucks, which is like kind of pricey for a gift bag when you can go to Dollar Tree get a gift bag. But look how cute this is. I don't know whose gift I'm putting in here, but somebody's gonna get a cute ass bag. And when I tell you I'm snatching it right back up once they get it, yeah, because I'm a re gifting that because that is too cute to just gift it and go for them to just throw it away. Mm -mm. And then here's this one, which is so cute. But I think I'm gonna save this one for Haley's gift, little Haley, not my roommate Haley, but little baby Haley. Um, I haven't gotten her gift yet, and I really don't know what I'm gonna get her. But rolls of ribbon, it's got a plain, like medium thickness black one, and then like a sparkly, like skinny one. That'd be cute. And I ended up getting this wrapping paper, which is reversible and has the polka dots on the other side. So I got the green bow to tie in the green. But not least, I got the stuff for the cookies. I heard there's like this whole thing that Crumble is basing their cookie bases off of. Uh, they've been basing their cookies off of like Betty Crocker like cookie mix. I wanted to try that. I just got the cinnamon toast crunch because I feel like that was like a universal cookie that everyone likes in this house. I don't like chocolate chip squash that i hate chocolate chip cookies like it's just not for me it ain't it. and we all love like cinnamon rolls and stuff like that so i thought this would be one that everyone would eat that's my little walmart haul was that 43 dollars worth no but am i happy with everything that i got yes i love a good i love giving i love making my gifts look cute i give stuff out like i love the whole vibe i don't mind it but whew, that was my little spiel i'm about to sit down eat these fries i might find something else to eat with it but at this point it's like i, I just don't know what i'm gonna eat so i'm gonna sit down and eat these fries probably some of these apples that'll be it come back to y'all either when we are baking the cookies or yeah but i need to go put this cup away before my sister walks in the door oh i also need to take my final y'all don't let me forget that gee i'll probably take that take that before start wrapping or making the cookies check y'all later mm -mm. Asparagus is too mushy. Why is it like that? We don't need to do this. I know it's too much, but I was gonna say. No. Sorry. I don't know who cooks this. But that asparagus is not hitting. Close it. Sure off. Okay. You in? I'm ready. Ignore my hair. Okay, it's a flea in my hand. You see a flea? Nope. Okay. Well, let's do three backflips, okay? You ready? You gotta watch the flea. 
You have to watch the play. Why are you laughing? I can't see because you have hands up. I'm sorry. Ready? I'm still flipping the answer. You'll see from Okay, go. Ready? Yeah. One, two, three. Seriously now? Okay. <laughs> well, can you hold the fleece jacket? Can you hold the jacket? It's Gucci. <laughs> Thank you. All right, let's so do two more back then. Back foot, okay? Ready? One. Watch. Two. You see it now? No. Okay. Well, hold the pants. Fake with you too. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> yeah. One more. You see? Yeah, the same boat. I did it. Where's he now? In my hand? The sleeves in your hand? No. <laughs> oh, whose outfit's in my hand? Do you see the sleeve in my hand? No. So why are you holding the clothes? Did you get to me? But there's no flea in my hand, so why you want to She's still holding them. You still holding them? <laughs>